Hello friends. So today in this video, we're gonna discuss another problem from Lead Code, which is a hard problem. So the problem name is minimum insertion steps to make a string palindrome. So the problem is very simple. It just states that you are given a string s, and you have to tell how many different characters you have to insert. The minimum number of characters you have to insert in this string so that the string will become palindrome. Now you have to first find and understand the characteristics of palindrome. The, the characteristics of palindrome is. Like if you read the like the string from the start to back and from back to start, they are like same, okay. Or if you divide the string into two halves, then the the, the string will become same, okay. If you read, so you can understand by this example, this string is a palindrome because as you can see, if you divide the string, so it's a mirror image over the middle. So Z Z Z Z N A. Now what you can think in this problem is, it's a clear dynamic programming problem. Now because also you can see the constraints are small, but what you can See in this problem is how you can draw the problem. I will show you with the example part. This is this is the palindrome only, so the answer is zero. But just see this example. M B A M. So M B A D M. Okay. Now what you can see in this problem is like what the first thing it comes to my mind is okay. If I have to form this a palindrome, then how you can define different states? The different states. to find out or like if you want to make this into a palindrome what you can think is how you can like broke down this problem into smaller problem okay so as you can see the first and the last characters are same okay if the first and the last character are same i if i can make this can i find out the minimum number of steps to make this a palindrome b and d b a d the minimum number of steps to make bad a palindrome is same as the minimum number of steps to make m bad m as a palindrome why because putting m and m in the end doesn't make any difference because if you put m and m in the end it is actually forming a palindrome only palindrome means that if you start from the start and back both the characters are same because they are same it is actually giving me that it is some part of a palindrome and if you just make the middle part palindrome then obviously that will be a palindrome because if i somehow let's assume that if i put b okay if i put like a d a d b if i insert a d here okay and i insert a b here and it will become this string and if you again recombine this part with the whole part which was left this will eventually form a palindrome if i form the if i somehow make the middle string palindrome then i will make this string palindrome also so that what i can do is i can make two pointers i and j to actually define the states so the i and j actually will help me to find out whether if i and j are same if i and j are same which means that these two points are same the characters in i and j are same it means that the number of steps to make this string palindrome is equal to number of steps or number of characters you have to insert to make this string palindrome so if dp of ij for this string is equal to dp of i minus 1 j minus 1 sorry so i plus 1 and j minus 1 so i is incre incremented by 1 which is like i plus 1 this point and j minus 1 which is this point so if you find out for this length the number of steps or insertion to make this a palindrome is same as the number of insertion to make this as a palindrome but if they are different if this is equal to b then the state can be for dp of ij to make this this length ij a palindrome is equal to you have to find out the minimum number of steps so either what i can do here is i can insert a character at this point to make this a palindrome so it can be like this m b a d b what i i can have two uh, steps i can either put a m at this end i can put a m at this end and now i can find out the number of steps to make this a palindrome or because see this is the this is the string the string is this m b a d b let's do that this is the string the two case can be because the characters i and j are this and they are not same so the two case can be i can either put a m here and the, then the minimum number of steps to make this is a, this as a palindrome which is like b so i will make this a d b and m so i have inserted a m here and then the string which is left is this because then the minimum number of steps to make this as a palindrome is my problem or i can insert a b at the start so it can be like this b 
and then M B A D and B so because either if I insert a B at the start then this will become a part which I want to make a palindrome and because I've inserted one character the total number of positions will increase by one so the uh, other DP state can be find out the minimum of both of these states the minimum of DP of as you can see I is in I plus one J or DP of I J minus one and increment this by one because one step has been taken and this is the DP states and you have to just find out all over all the possible DP states just do a recursion and use memorization to find out the answer so that's what I've done in this problem so first because the length is 500 make the memorization table and the steps can be zero also that's why I don't initialize a DP table with zero initialize with minus one because if you haven't seen that then this is n and the two i and j to make this okay function I will send the string s and because I have to iterate over the string s and also the two pointers the first point is at zero index and the last point is n minus one so the base conditions can be the first condition can be if both s and e are same if if there is only one character which is a then the answer is zero because there is no steps are required or if as you can see if the string can be less than the string is a a and my i and j is at this point what i've told you the dp state of this is equal to when you both of them are same you will find out a dp state for this problem is you will subtract your add i plus one and j minus one and now i will come to this point and j will come to this point so they have interchange and now this is also not a valid state because i is greater than j so in that case also if i becomes greater than j i or j or you can start a start or end if start becomes greater than end or they become same then answer is zero because in that case no steps are required else if you have find out the state answer for that state then the answer is just return out that dp state okay so or else there are two states the first is the so this is i and j you can start and end if the character at the start and character at the end are same then the dp of that state the value is equal to call the ok function again with s plus one and e minus one and if they are different what you'll do you have two options the first option can be increment the s by one and remain e as it is and answer will increase by one or else e decrease by one and s will remain the same and answer will increase by one and find out the minimum them and that's the dp this okay is like this is not of use i'm just written on here uh, so you can also like write down this at the end okay so yeah. this is also working perfectly fine so that's the logic and code for this problem if you still have any words you can mention on i'll send us one till then keep coding and bye